Hey guys, Mike here and in this clip we're going to have a look at the finger scanner on the Samsung Galaxy S5. Now the finger scanner is integrated within this uh, physical home button. As a result the button is a bit noisier, a bit uh, clickier, but uh, it's uh, working quite okay and it's a feature that you might like on this particular device. Um, for starters let me show you how to add a finger uh, print, how to add a fingerprint of course. Uh, you need to go to the settings, go to device and here on the bottom you have finger scanner and um, in here you have the fingerprint manager. You have to tap on the fingerprint manager and register your first fingerprint. Uh, this small uh, animation here shows you exactly what you should do. You should go ahead and swipe your finger over the sensor going from up, down to the bottom of, uh, of the phone like this several times and once it's done you have to introduce a password and I'm going to put my name as a password. It's important to remember this password because uh, in some uh, cases you will uh, need uh, the, pass the password if you enable fingerprint protection and now you have to you can enable fingerprint locked. And um, this helps you unlock the screen by using your fingerprint. Right now we have the pattern fingerprint uh, um, locking. Let's go ahead and change it on fingerprint. And now we're using fingerprint, um, this fingerprint lock mode to protect our phone. And you can go ahead and swipe your finger over it in order to unlock it, or if you if you're not the person whose fingerprint is uh, recognized by the phone, you can just go ahead and introduce the alternative password, like this. Now, uh, why, I, why I said that it's important to remember that uh, particular password is because if you, um, uh, if you want to go now and change the screen lock mode to something else, you'll need to introduce that password before you'll be able to, to make any changes. And now we can change it to something else, but we're, we're going to stick with fingerprint for now. Um, what other things you can do with your fingerprint? Where well, you can verify your Samsung account. So instead of introducing your Samsung account when uh, buying stuff from, uh, from the store and using other Samsung services, you can use your fingerprint instead. Uh, it also works with uh, PayPal payments. Uh, it's a nice integrated app on uh, this uh, particular device. And uh, you can also protect uh, content on your phone by using the private mode uh, with the help of your, uh, of your fingerprint. For that you have to activate private mode and select the fingerprint protection. Swipe over the sensor and now the private mode is turned on. Uh, the private mode basically allows you to hide different uh, files on your device, images, videos, uh, documents, uh, and only be able to access them in this private mode. Otherwise, those are not visible. For instance, if we go in here, in the gallery app, you can go ahead and select a couple of images and add them to private, move to private, and now if uh, we weren't on, uh, on this private mode, we, we wouldn't be able to actually uh, see all this, uh, all this content that uh, wasn't uh, private. And now the private mode is on and you can of course go ahead and turn it off. Okay, so you can protect all these files with uh, the help of your fingerprint. Hopefully other applications will use the fingerprint protection in, uh, in the future. Uh, all the information about the fingerprint is stored locally on your phone, so um, it's more or less, uh, it's, it's close to impossible for anyone to, to be able to access uh, your fingerprint data and uh, uh, access your phone in, uh, in this uh, way. So it's a very secure way of uh, protecting uh, your phone and uh, the content on your phone. Okay, that's about it for now. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them below or anything to add.
of course. And if you're interested in more details on the Samsung, uh, on the Samsung Galaxy S5, make sure to check them out on the channel. Uh, I've covered pretty much all the important aspects of this particular device. Um, for now, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.